Hi, this is Mark Fisher, the host of Crosswalk, with a look at the band September. I'll be right back to talk with September about the music from their new album, Dreams and Lessons. The members of September are Russ and Doug Kirkland and their sister, Dale Tiemann. The new album is called Dreams and Lessons. It's your third record. That's you know, right. You don't claim the first one or you don't. It's officially <laughs> our third. At what point did Dreams and Lessons come about as a title? It's really, it has to do with just a lot of the things that have interested us. I like to read and, and articles, certain articles like Animal Land was stimulated from a reading, I've collected these articles on, on uh, runaway kids and the way basically we treat each other in society and stuff. And I was just trying to find some kind of a title that tied it all together because some of the things we were writing about were things we knew about personally and other things that we were writing about were things that we could only dream that it might be like. And, um, and yet I felt like there was a lesson in most of the songs. If anybody wanted to listen uh, with without thinking they could enjoy it, but if they wanted to look deeper, I thought there was a lesson in every song. A lot of your songs, you can see a lot of different levels taking place here. On one level, okay, it's, as I see it, a fighter pilot who's off on patrol and his thoughts are preoccupied with some sort of a broken relationship in his life. Boy, nail on the head, Very guy. Good, okay. Mark. And then, this man's a thinker. And then at the same time, okay, the fact his job is a symbol of the larger broken relationship. That's exactly right. Okay. Something I thought of was, uh, as a Christian, aren't we a guardian of peace? Aren't, don't we look out for people who can't defend themselves, like unborn children, uh, you know, fighting against abortion or looking out for the right in this world, constantly having to check our six for the enemy that we definitely have as Christians that's trying to trip us up. And, you know, it can be applied to a Christian life too. We can't just float through this life saying I have a ticket to heaven and an easy way of life, but be responsible as uh, for the truths that we know. I am guardian of the cold red light. I carry thunder in these wings of mine. High in the stratus of the time and space. High am the eagle of the human race. I'm checking my seat. Wings to horizon songs that you are willing to risk misinterpretation. I think if we were to try and wrap the story up with here's a sad situation and here's a wonderful answer and it concludes and everything's like that, I think that's misrepresenting what life is, you know, because life is not like that. 
real life is a little bit more of sometimes not being able to see exactly what God's doing in your life, but being faithful to it in any way. So yeah, there's no big rosy conclusions to a lot of the songs, but I think real life is a little bit more like that. And God calls us to be faithful to what he's, He wants us to do and the way He's asked us to live, whether we see a rosy ending to it or not. Music has an unusual effect on that one. Uh, the gorgeous vocals on that, you know, make you think, oh, this is a real peppy, optimistic kind of song. You pull the lyric sheet out, wow, this guy is really <laughs> having trouble here. You, I've never heard a group make uh, failure sound so uh, appealing. Or, uh... <laughs> there are a lot of things in life, I think, that don't work out like we want them to. We can't let that get us down, but just get up and try, try again. And, uh, don't fool ourselves by telling us that we can expect everything to be rosy for us. When you're in that state of mind, you don't want anybody giving you a pat answer or saying everything's just going to be fine all by itself or everything will work out. You feel like, no, it isn't going to work out and I want a little sympathy. <laughs> and those songs hit you where you're at, just as Paul on Mars Hill talked directly to those people where they stood I think these songs hopefully can do that and grab their attention. You've been listening to an interview with the members of September, Russ Kirkland, Doug Kirkland, and Dale Teeman 
I'm Mark Fisher from the Crosswalk Radio Show. Thanks for joining me.